You said in an interview that your parents abused you. Your father's denying that. And I understand this. The abuse topics that I brought up, I shared because I thought it would help others who do not, do not talk about this. And there is just abuse prevalently in my family. So it wasn't just my parents who were abusing. It was other sides of my family. The one day that, you know, it showed on Teen Mom, the cops were called, and my mother and I got in a fight. That was a changing point for me. My father has done other things, and I could tell you the day, I could tell you what he did, and I have moved on from those things. I mean, my dad's writing a book. Maybe he'll be open in his book about that. I, I don't want to make my parents out to be bad. I'm actually in a good place with my parents right now, but I do not stand for abuse. I talk to my dad on a personal level, and he does know I'm hurt by it. And I just think maybe he, not, he may not want to share that publicly, and he probably just doesn't want to deal with that on a public level. Lots of people think I lie a lot. Lots of people love to say fair or fake things, and these things happen. I, and I think this has always happened even before. I was in gossip magazines and those things. And now I just can say, because I'm a strong enough woman, I've been through so much, and I'm so happy I have myself together, and I've gone through therapy. Like, I just want other women and other men who have been abused and had hard times with their parents or sexual abuse when they get older and things happen, but it's not okay to be silent about it. I've been pretty abused, so I just felt that if, if it's the right time for me to share things, I do try to share. And I don't care if I get called a liar or not, things really happen.